When it comes to whether MASPI or MARPI is a better expansion protocol for adults, there's not a doubt that the MASPI protocol is a better protocol. It's actually shown to be more successful in actually opening and expanding the palate. That is, in some cases, the MARPI won't work, and in some cases, the MASPI won't work. But the MASP has been shown to open the palate 84% of the time, whereas the MARPI appliance has only been shown to open up the palate 50% of the time without surgical interventions. The other thing is the MASP protocol being slow actually puts wider pressure on the cranial bones and is three times less likely to deform and bend the cranial bones during the expansion process due to the light, gentler approach to treatment. Additionally, the MASPI protocol going slower gets the skeletal expansion over a longer period of time, and we don't see as many dental problems like large spaces happening between the teeth. That's not to say that we don't get any spaces, but the number of spaces and the amount of dental issues that leads to more complex orthodontics after MASPI versus MARPI, the MASPI leads to a situation where the orthodontics is not as complex. The other thing is the MASPI protocol is typically more comfortable. I, I see fewer complaints of people saying, my head hurts, my jaw hurts, because we go at a slower, more comfortable rate of expansion. So in general, I prefer the MASPI to the MARPI. Interestingly enough, this is actually a appliance and it can be used as a MASPI or a MARPI. They're essentially the same appliance. The only difference is how quickly we expand the appliance. But this is a bandless design where it connects to the pallet and puts a pressure on the micro screws, which is not connected to teeth. Of course, there are designs where it connects to both the teeth and the micro screws.